In this video, we're going to cover how to save and open files in Construct 3. To begin, you're going to want to make sure that you're logged into your Construct 3 account, and you'll see that you're logged in by seeing your username in the upper right hand corner. Let's begin by opening files in Construct 3. There are two places where you can save your files. You can either store them in the cloud, which is going to give you cloud options like Google Drive, or locally on your device, and you can access that via the file button here. Let's go through each example to see how that works. So let's begin with the cloud option. So we'll click on the cloud button, and that's going to ask to connect to our Google Drive. And so you'll select the account that you want to connect it to, and then in this little window you'll see your service, in this case Google Drive, there's also Dropbox and OneDrive. And then you'll be able to search for the file or use you know, your folder directory to locate the file. So here I've located my file and I know it's a Construct 3 file because it says um, it has the extension C3P. So once I've located it and I just use the search there, all you need to do is click open. So once you have your file open from the cloud in Construct 3, you're probably going to want to save it back into the cloud. So to do that, we can go ahead and click on menu project, save as, and cloud save. So what that's going to do is it's going to open that little window back up and you're going to be able to save it and you can overwrite certain files or save it as a new file depending on what you're looking to do. So here we're just going to overwrite that file and click save. And then it's going to ask you if you want to overwrite the file and click OK. So as you can see down here, it's saving it to Google Drive. It'll tell you what percentage it's at. But ultimately, that is how you save and open a file using the cloud option, in this case, Google Drive. Now let's go ahead and close out of this project and take a look at how you would open and save using a local file on your device. So a local file is just a file that is saved to your computer, your Chromebook, whatever device we're talking about here. So ultimately, to access a file on your local device, you would click on the File button, and this is going to open up a dialog box where you can then open up that, um, whether it's a C3P file or a CAPX, both are able to be opened in Construct 3. CAPX is just an older file, um, but is still compatible with Construct 3. So as you can see here, we have our downloads folder. That's what it's going to default to in, in my situation. Depending on where you save your files on your computer, what the, the default folder is, we'll take a look at, at that here in a second, um, that is where your files will be saved. But just like any file you save from the internet, you have the choice of where you save that file. So in this case, I've put the file in my downloads folder. I'm just going to click on that file. So here you can see the file that I device, my local device. Now let's talk about how we would save that file to our device. So just like with the cloud save option, we're going to go to menu, project, save as, and then we can click download a copy. What this is going to do is it's going to download a copy of the C3P file to our device. So I'm going to go ahead and click that button. I can choose to change the file name if I want, or I can just leave it and click OK. So after I've done that, you've noticed that in the bottom left-hand corner, you can see that it's been downloaded. If you're not sure where that file is going when you're saving to your device, you can easily do that by checking your browser settings. So I'm currently using Google Chrome, and that's the browser that we recommend for the use of our programs. Uh, so if you're using Google Chrome, you can simply go to your settings, within the browser and then click on advanced and that's going to give you a downloads option there. So I can see that currently the location on my device that my downloads from the browser are being saved to are in my downloads folder. But if you have another location that you prefer to save your downloads, you can always click change and choose the folder that you want your downloads to be going into when you save them. You can also ask where to save each file before downloading. That's another option within Chrome and other browsers. So instead of just automatically downloading into my downloads folder, I could choose to put it on my desktop or in a different folder than the rest of my files. So if you want that option, you can simply click this toggle and enable it. 
So that is how you can open and save projects in Construct 3 using both the cloud save and the local file save options. Be sure to check out our other tutorials to learn more about how to use Construct 3 and our STEMFUSE programs.